from the head, I'm a third year pharmacology student. I really started loving this course in second year when I did my first pharmacology paper. It's so interesting how broad pharmacology is, how different drugs act differently in the body, in different people, um, different parts of the, um, the body. So that was super interesting. And it's um, super special to be in Dunedin because it's such a student-friendly place. Um, you're always with your friends, you can walk everywhere, it's always a good time in Dunedin. Hello, I'm John Ashton, I'm an Associate Professor in, a, in Pharmacology and Toxicology here at the University of Otago. What is Pharmacology and Toxicology? Well, I can tell you my particular field of study is Pharmacology, and Pharmacology is the study of drugs. How do drugs work? How do they cure diseases? How do they, what bad effects can they have? and uh, how do they how are they process as they go through our body, as they enter our body and leave our body. So that, that goes into uh, medicine, it goes into pharmaceutical sciences, and it goes into a wide range of other social concerns like um, uh, drugs of abuse, uh, controlled drugs, um, new medicines and, and how people access them. So uh, <laughs> People might ask how, how we differ from pharmaceutical sciences. Well, we really study how drugs work right at the, in, in the body and the, and the molecules rather than how they're put together as a medicine. So one of the things that's really distinctive about pharmacology and toxicology is, is like the flip side of it. So at a particular dose, something might be a medicine, might be beneficial. At a higher dose, it might be a toxin. So we're, we're always balancing those two things. But what is different about pharmacology, and you can see this that we don't start until year two. We don't have a year one pharmacology paper. And the reason for this is pharmacology is innately an integrative, interdisciplinary discipline. That is to say, you've got to know biochemistry, chemistry, physiology, um, uh, anatomy, and so forth. So you've got to have that ba background before you can put it together and understand how a drug works. How does a, a, a molecule work on a protein to cause an effect in an entire body and so forth. So you've got to be able to think about these different fields. So we start at year two and therefore it rewards and encourages those sort of students who or people who like to think integratively rather than reductively. And not just across the disciplines in academia, but across levels of social concern. So you've got the, the pure research, the curiosity driven stuff, you've got the how does this help people um, in society, there is the public policy, how do we regulate this drug, is it going to be a problem, is it causing people to die or become addicted, and then there is a development of, of course, new drugs, drug discovery. So we find that our graduates go into a, a lot of different related areas. You might think that, well, apart from research, what is there? Well, internationally, pharmaceutical re uh, companies are huge employers of, of pharmacology graduates or postgraduates at least. But beyond that, there are, we find our graduates going into a lot of different areas in policy making and different government departments. Um, we have someone uh, in Dunedin who set up a science writing uh, company. Uh, we have graduates working for tech companies. We have um, and startups. We have uh, graduates working as uh, sales and technical representatives for pharmaceutical companies in, in right here in New Zealand. So there's a wide range of positions that that expertise in pharmacology can give you.